2002 jam question on biology question number one an amoeba and an only chicken egg are what an amoeba and only chicken egg are what organisms now the question is what is organism an organism is uh, are the name given to every living thing amoeba is an unicellular organism because they have one cell only chicken egg are, let's say, is a developing embryo that will, is just um, is a developing embryo of a chicken. So the only chicken egg contains an embryo which also contains the organisms that is developing in it. So you see, amoeba and only chicken egg are organisms. Now, question number two: In comes Food is usually stored in the what? In comes, food is usually stored in the what? Underground. In the what? Underground. Stems. So in comes, food are stored in the underground stem. Now what is com? A com, e.g., example of coms are cocoyam. They are underground short swollen stem base that grows vertically now they are perinating organs so those plants whose um, crops grow on the ground that is inside the soil are called the combs that's why we say that food is usually stored in the underground stems question number three the animal that moves by means of um, flagella include what what are the animals that move by means of flagella? They are one, Cla Clamod Clamidomonas, Clamidomonas, and then we have the Euglena. They are the plants that grow by means of what? The flagella. They use the flagella to move. That is for locomotive process. Now, question number four. The structure found only in the plant cells are what? There are some structures you found only on the plant cell, but you don't find them in animal cells. Example, the cell wall. The cell wall which contains cellulose. And secondly, we have the second one, which is um, the chloroplast. The chloroplast contains chlorophyll which enables the plant to carry out photosynthesis. These are the basic um, structures possessed by plant cell that you can't find in animal cell. So you see, the cell wall and the chloroplasts are found in plant cell, whereas they, are where they can't find them in animal cell. Question number five. A flower that has both stamen and pistil is said to be what? Is said to be a perfect said to be a perfect or you can say a complete flower now because it contains a stamen the stamen part we call it with term it androasium and then we have the one that contains the pistil the pistil is called the gynosium. Now, we call it a perfect flower because it is the essential part of the flower because they are involved in sexual reproduction. So you see a perfect flower contains the stamen and the pistil. So because they undergo or carry out sexual reproduction.